Welcome back to a Monday episode of Geocaching with you got a friend in PA and Rob, the geocaching muggle. Three caches, three DNFs, three finds, and we're going to finish this geo art once and for all. Time to go find our first DNF cache when I was by myself. You ready for an adventure? Yep. We're going to have fun. I got my lucky charm. We got this. If I can't find it, I know he will. Time to go catch him. Welcome to Geocaching with You Got a Friend in PA. Co-starring Rob, the geocaching mobile. From urban to mountaintop cache adventures. And everything in between. From micro to others. And, and even nanos, nanos too. too. Are you ready to have your geo senses tested? Here comes your challenge for today. Okay, folks, we're gonna start this off. Before we show you cache one, I have a question. I've been pondering this for the past month, talking with Robbie off camera about it. I wanna hear from my geocaching family. That's what I'm going to call us from now on. All my subscribers, all my viewers, we're a geocaching family. We all have the same hobby that we like to do. Now, here's my question. Do you guys like the GeoSense challenges the way they are now? Three caches, some kind of short, some kind of long, depends on how much we play around. Or... Would you like to see three short GeoSense challenges throughout the week? Where it'll be Monday, Wednesday, Friday. One cache each, two to three minutes long. Simple, pop in, take the challenge, and go on about your day. And save yourself 15, 20 minutes. Or, the third option. A daily GeoSense challenge. Where every day... There will be a challenge released on the channel for you to quick pop in and watch. Again, two to three minutes long, no extra footage, just here's the container, here's ground zero, here's the elimination, and then that's it. Now, don't worry. I am going to sprinkle in stories. I have ideas that I want to do for stories that aren't going to be a GeoSense challenge. I got historical places I want to bring to you guys with geocaches that are there. So I'm going to have stories also. But just for the GeoSense challenges, just to maybe make the videos a little shorter, um, because the analytics of the videos kind of show people aren't watching a whole 12 to 15 minute video. But maybe you are, and maybe YouTube is telling me something wrong. So this is your opportunity right now to help me out and to help yourself out and to help out the geocaching family that likes to watch my channel. What do you prefer? I know you all like the videos. I get a lot of thumbs up. I got great comments and I appreciate every single one of them. I'm just confused on whether you guys want long videos, short videos, playing around videos, or just get to the point videos. Let me know in the comments. Also, Take the poll. Let me know. Keep it the same. One, one cache three times a week or a daily GeoSense challenge. Thank you in advance for your feedback. Let's go geocaching. Wow. All right. A very long search for this container. Let's rewind back in time. When I originally done this geo art, I DNF this the first time. So I was looking for something different. Came back a second time. I DNF'd it. Because I was looking for something different. I found a cache, part of this geo art, that looks similar to an area that's here. Again, came back thinking it was the same type of hide as one I previously found. 
again DNF this little guy. That'd be a big no. Fourth time back. You guessed it. DNF it again. Number five for me. Robbie's first time here. But I didn't find it though. Finally. Finally. I don't care who found it. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm happy I did. You were here five times. Uh, month, so I don't want him thinking I found it. Yeah. Very tricky hide. Very tricky on the uh, hint also. The hint really makes you think about other things besides what it actually is. But then when you finally put it all together, you can make the find. Now, our game plan next is to go avenge another DNF. Same geo art, same trail, just further down. Looks like something over here. Hmm. Ah, there you are. Hiding close by. Avenged another DNF. This one was sticking right out, so this is not where it was my last time here. There is no way I missed this easy hide. Not at all. Uh, this is the micro, two difficulty, two terrain, pill bottle. Like I said, I really can't show you where it is. I promised I wouldn't. So, now, we avenged two DNFs on this geo art now let's go see if we can avenge our third one all right folks he's a man <laughs> all him today let me explain a, a few things uh I'm, I'm technologically impaired today mm -hmm. All of my electronics have just been giving me problems. Whether it's filling up a hard drive with video and having to d make up your mind whether you're going to delete any or not. Whether it's uh, your GPS lying to you and you stumble across a final ammo can and you're still 130 feet away. Then it catches up to you and you realize, yeah. okay. Then mm -hmm. you, you find it, you pull it out, you're like, well, it's the right one. The logbook says so. And then you look at your GPS again, and you're 42 feet. <laughs> the geo art that I worked on, it's the Ride... Cache or Die. Yeah, Ride, Cache, or Die series. 58 geocaches, including the final that you have to figure out, or that you have to get the cords for. Um... It makes the multi-cross on the map. Here's a picture of all smileys now. Yes! Uh, I'd like to give a shout out to Saint FU for maintaining and putting out the series for everybody to geocache. Uh, I can't show you where it was because I promised not to show his cache hides anymore. Uh, I just wanted to bring the container. I mean, everybody knows what an ammo can looks like anyway. Mm -hmm. So, we got it. All of them, finally, avenged three DNFs today. And now it's time to once again do what we normally do at the end of the video. Thank you. Happy trails. Happy caching. And go get yourself a smiley. Hello to all our new subscribers, all our old subscribers, all our subscribers, uh, all our subscribers, blah, 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 blah. Try to get out out three times straight. And stay safe and stay healthy. And welcome to the Geocache family. Oh.